Imagine naming your daughter after the nightclub she was conceived in. <laughs> Hello, what's that crack? What's the story? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out some Kevin Bridges. This is It's Rough in Glasgow. I've been doing loads of reactions on Glasgow lately. Billy Connolly has been talking about Glasgow and I've been watching Steel Game. So yeah, check out Steel Game. I posted episode one and episode two. Check out the Patreon if you haven't seen it. Let's go. When you travel down south and you tell people you're from Glasgow, they get quite excited. They go, Glasgow, yeah, it's really quite rough, isn't it? Really violent, yeah. And you kind of get proud. And you go, oh, aye, oh, aye. <laughs> yeah, a lot, of, a lot of tough guys. Oh, aye, a lot of tough guys. Yeah. <laughs> And they visit the place. And I'm so sorry. I find that more funny because I'm watching Steel Game and I'm always really hearing Victor and Jack saying, oh, hi, hi, hi. Yeah, yeah, hi. Yeah, hi. So I find that really more funny because I'm, I'm I'm so used to a lot of Scottish comedy lately. So there's some little stuff that Kevin Bridges used to say that I just didn't get. Now, I'm getting everything now. Sorry. Let's continue. I'm a bit disappointed. No, I've got... <laughs> we're trying to get away from the stereotypes. We've got a, a new promotional tourist campaign called Glasgow. Scotland with style. Now, have they seen the posters? It's one of these kind of homogenised posters of people supposed to be the new face of Glasgow. People with names like Nathan. <laughs> now, every major city advertises the happy people like Nathan, and it's this guy's in the poster, Nathan, sales assistant, proud Glaswegian. I don't think a sales assistant called Nathan is a fair representation of any major city. <laughs> I think major cities should play up to their stereotypes on the billboards advertising your city. Show them real people like we mental Davy. <laughs> Apprentice joiner. <laughs> Father of six. <laughs> Davies there, in the billboard with the six kids all tucked into the one tracksuit. <laughs> A Lacoste tracksuit, and only the best. Lacoste? La that used to be a famous brand. Lacoste, oh my god, I'm getting flashbacks. The grey tracksuit, Lacoste tracksuit, that used to be big back in the day. Wow. All well, these kids, they're all dressed up for their granny. Lacoste tracksuit, and only the best. <laughs> For these kids, they're all dressed up for their granny's fair <laughs> <laughs> Ah, stop, stop. <laughs> granny's 38. No, no, no. What? <laughs> granny's 38. <laughs> That's taking a piece of Glaswegians. Glaswegians? Glaswegians? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> You've got the six kids, you've got Keanu, you've got Sigourney. <laughs> Destiny, that's a new one, I heard. Destiny. Imagine naming your daughter after the nightclub she was conceived in. <laughs> <laughs> this is Destiny, and this is my son, the garage. <laughs> Destiny in the garage. <laughs> that was really good. That was really, really good. That was so short as well. Oh my God. Kevin Bridges. It's just one of them comedians that, you know, I feel like no, if you know my average going, I don't listen to comedy, you wouldn't know him. You know, the, you know, people like, you know, Ricky Gervais, uh, maybe Lee Evans, but Kevin Bridges is very, very good. I'm surprised he's not as big than I thought he should be anyway. But you guys know what I'm talking about. If you guys like this kind of stuff, you're gonna watch more. Like, comment, subscribe, check out the Patreon, check out the membership, and I'll see you soon. Hi, bye-bye.